The following is the audiobook for Kyle Reardon's 2016 anthology, Just Below the Surface, A Guide to Security Culture. Forward by Shane Radliff. Kyle's been a major advocate and pioneer in the field of security culture ever since I made his acquaintance in March of 2015. His knowledge and advice on the subject led to my advocacy and practice of this strategy where I am able to in my own life. I use encryption, I have role-played police interrogations, and have even utilized those skills in encounters with the bludgies, aka police extortionists, and I act as the gray man whenever I am able. That said, the practice of security culture has never been more important. Having archived the court documents for over 30 political prisoners, I think that alone is demonstrative of that fact, although there are other examples such as the life-invasive tools now available to the state in modern times. With even a lackadaisical application, it is safe to say that at least a number of the current political prisoners would still be enjoying the limited freedoms they had left, instead of wasting away as they now are in a government dungeon. And this anthology provides an overall in-depth analysis of various security measures, such as secured record archival, making your car inconspicuous, home hardening, and much more. Not only does he critique methods already available, he expands upon them and even includes his novel contributions, such as Gary Hunt's proposal of dual-layer encryption. Those who don't know history are doomed to repeat it, and he is fully aware of that fact. So much so that he provides a historical analysis of topics like social security, the blatant failures of activist organizations, and even the surveillance police state apparatus, among others. He also examines the viability of certain tactics, such as overloading the NSA servers with suspicious email keywords, as well as the practice of putting up fanciful notices informing the bludgies that you are aware of and exercising your rights. As naive as those sound, and rightfully so, Kyle's humorous critiques should put those to rest, but I don't see the reformists giving up their activist highs that easily. The overall result of this anthology is yet to be seen, but nonetheless, it is an extremely important, indispensable contribution he's made to the alternative media, as well as anyone else who gives a damn about their privacy. Before beginning your endeavor, I feel it's important to provide you with a warning. Some of the articles you read may scare you, and that's certainly understandable. The NSA collecting phone calls and metadata isn't even the tip of the iceberg. At times, you may feel violated, but in order to defeat, or defend yourself from your enemy, you must first know the tactics they are utilizing to spell on every facet of your life, or more broadly, to enslave you. Are you going to take the steps necessary in exercising your right to privacy? Your answer to that question is more important than you could ever imagine. Shane Radliff, Bloomington, Illinois, July 2016.